news that my school's funding is at risk. And that because my school is not diverse enough, the money which aids my girls will not be received. The seed the school board has been, they say, they say that they thought we taught the way to innocence, to bliss, that you let women to their destiny and dreams with extreme measure, which we believe was a misconception due to the styles by animators everywhere. Now I try to defend my school and its lack of diversity, but they told me that hair color is not a diversity factor. <laughs> So, as headmistress, I'm here to say that my school's funding is gone, the river has run dry, and no longer can Little Mermaid swim in it. Cinderella, you will have to go back to cleaning cinders and snow white. Your stepmother is waiting for you at bus stop six. Please don't forget your sunscreen. Because Disney's charm school for young ladies is coming to a close. Those clothes you have on, Belle, please return them to the beach. Because apparently we lack diversity. Apparently we do not show girls that they are more than their looks. Or that they can be independent. Or that their goal should consist of more than just wanting a prince to save them. Now, Cinderella, I think your song, A Dream is a Wish Your Name, <laughs> is amazing, but apparently your wishes should consist of more than a prince saving you because apparently you should be capable of saving yourself. I don't know, the school board is crazy. Yeah. I try to tell them that Nala, Nala has black in her. I mean, she is from the alley. <laughs> But then they did say that that only made it worse because that meant that the only black Disney princess is an animal. And then Ariel's red hair, so much black hair, balls, brown hair, so girls, blonde hair. And Sleeping Beauty's green eye, but there's only anything more. And a rainbow the size and the whiteness of every single one of those girls' skin. They said Snow White, you were satisfied with being a housewife, and that little, little girl should aspire to be more than that. They said that. You define beauty as and white. I said that. I don't know what you're talking about. But there was a whole <laughs> list of complaints. Like, why is that the Little Mermaid thought it was worth giving up her voice for a man? Why is that your enemies have ethnic voices while the heroes have white ones? Why is that your racist girls to be soft spoken and speak their mind? Why is that you're leaving them saying, I need a man to save me? Why couldn't the girl refer to as beauty be the last? No, I do not choose who attends this strong school for young ladies. I just run the place, but no, the place is run down because the school board is sick of racist, sexist shit. And happily ever after it is not a legitimate. What? Neither is a good services. Neither is saying to let animals off that move or abuse of families. Neither is wait for a man to fix it. And neither is who cares why it's so freaking perfect. But luckily no. for you, I just so happen to be out to have very legit, legit degrees to kiss my black ass. Oh my. But uh, now, Jasmine, they did say you were great. You were fantastic. Very horrid. However, she's also a slut with the skimpiest outfit ever. But I mean, psh, a foreign princess can't be classy like Miss Cinderella. Then no, she has to be shown on her black ass like no tomorrow because if she didn't, there'll be no tomorrow because no flat ass would be no prince because no prince would be attracted to a foreign princess who wouldn't show them off her flat ass and if she had no prince, her life would be over. Cover to cover, I have run up on loopholes, wormholes, undertoes to try to make this money flow, but it looks like this is no wonderland, girls, and I'm not going to be able to shrink small enough to sneak into a bank or grow big enough to take one over, so as headmistress, I'm here to say that Disney's